in this game oh my lord what's good youtube never 92 here back again once again today people today we are back for episode number 10 of our pokemon liquid crystal randomized nuzz lock and for those of you guys that can't tell yes i am sick i am sick i am sick i am sick and for those of you guys that don't know if you don't if you're not following on twitter or you haven't been paying attention to the other videos that have been uploaded um 
I did a 10 packs east in Boston this past weekend. That's why there haven't been any uploads or a shit ton of uploads, I should say, over the past couple days. Um, I really, really wanted to get some uploads scheduled for you guys while I was gone, but uh, when it came, when it comes crashing down and it hurts inside, oh, bound, bound it down. Anyways, let me stop. <laughs> uh, when it came down to it on Wednesday, I just didn't have enough time. I had to get Lumio Station squared away, and uh, I only had time to get top five and last Friday's episode of Liquid Crystal. So it's been almost a week since we had Liquid Crystal, which sucks, but we're back at it now. So um, the daily Liquid Crystal episode should be back, back again once again. And hopefully, me having a cold doesn't stop that from happening. I'm gonna basically what's gonna happen is I'm just gonna record until my throat hurts too much to go anymore. Um, Cause I know some of you guys don't like filler episodes. You don't like episodes where there's not a whole lot of shit that gets done, yada yada yada, etc. 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 So I'm gonna try my best to just pump out these Luca Crystal episodes for you guys. Um, and of course, you guys already know the drill. Go ahead, skip ahead a couple minutes if you want to skip the team preview, because um, I'm gonna talk about some things. Because we did have a grinding montage, so we did do some grinding. Um, but yeah, I did some grinding here in Azalea Town. Doesn't it suck? Episode 10 and we're still in fucking Azalea Town. It pisses me off so much. This Let's Play has had so many just fucking road bumps. It just, just fucking bump after bump after bump after bump. But I came down here to do some grinding and bitch ass slowpoke well and sneak in the Murkrow was our first capture. But everything else in that fucking well, if you guys ever played Minecraft and you've ever experienced a dungeon, then you already know that that was a fucking dungeon down there. They had fucking Withdrawal, Protect, Aurora Beam, Cloisters, Poison Point, Cedras, fuck Poison Point, fuck third gen games, you know what, the game, third gen just doesn't like me, after the Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke where I got screwed over by that wall rain, the Fire Red Leaf Green Versus with fucking Callum where I got screwed over the entire time, and now this bullshit liquid crystal, I'm done with third gen, we might as well just, let's just go back to sixth gen, do that Pokemon X Wonderlock everyone wants to do, so I don't know, I don't know. but still, they have fucking cute charm Wigglytuffs, um, fucking, uh, Poison Point Cedras, Poison Point is what, like 30% chance to poison? No, no, go back and watch that fucking grinding montage. Literally, every seizure that I ran into poisoned one of my Pokemon. Pissed me the hell off. Pissed me off so bad. There was one seizure I remember, uh, it, three of my Pokemon got poisoned off of one seizure. That is more than 30%. I don't give a fuck what anybody says. That's more than 30%. So fuck Poison Point, fuck seizures, fuck all that stupid shit. You guys also wanted me to um, train up Nimbus or Alteria. And Lupita, Lupita, the lady who makes the best enchiladas, this is the Mississippi. Lady is so ass. I'm just letting you guys know that right now. But let's get a quick party update for you guys. We have Juvia, the horsey, who's only level 17. I didn't get a chance to do any uh, leveling on her because all the Pokemon that were in that cave, like, bubbled and do shit too. Because, like I said, Cloyster, Seedra, Wigglytuff, Murkrow, Magnemite. Like, there's, there's just no, I just couldn't train it there, so I didn't want to lose it, so it's still level 17, still adequately leveled, it's kind of sort of high level enough, I might do some switch training with it just until it gets some more moves. Then we have Saturn the Dragonair, yes, Saturn is still here, originally Saturn was not supposed to be in the party, like I said, I replaced the Nimbus with it, but I'll get to that in a minute. But Rap, Lear, Thunder Wave, and Twister, level 17 as well. Then we have Tittuck, our Magmar, level 19, Ember, Leer, Smog, Fire Punch, I was training this, uh, our target goal was level 20. But I stopped with Magmar because it's like, we're just going to get training in the gym anyway. He's going to run house all over it. Then we have Lupita, the lady, at level 20. Got him leveled up, or her leveled up, uh, about 11 levels. And I'm trying to get my ears to pop right now, and they won't do it. I hate being sick. Oh, my God. I hate being sick so much. But Tackle, Supersonic, and Comet Punch, all normal type moves, nothing stab. Let's check out Lupita. What is Lupita? She's got Early Bird. A naughty nature. Doesn't naughty raise attack? I thought Naughty raised attack. I don't know. Either way, it's special defense and speed are its highest stats. So, yay. It's special attack is higher than its attack. What the fuck? What the fuck does Naughty do? I don't know what Naughty does off the top of my head, so. Oh well. But either way, um, all I know is Lupita is straight booty. Straight ass. Straight garbage. Sadie, come here. Come here. Sadie, come over here and sit down. She hears one sound. I had to go, like, just now, go and see what the hell she was doing. Because she was in the backyard raising all types of cane. Sit down. Thank you. Anyway, so yeah, so Lupita is straight booty, not worried about Lupita at all, and then Drax, of course, is level 20, quiet nature, just chilling here, being the almighty powerhouse that he is. I want him to learn something more than just bite. Oh my lord, I mean, I know that it's good for him because we have the physical special split in this gen that stab for him, and that powerful 62 attack, woo! I love it, I love it, I love it, but still, I want him to learn something other than bite because he's got Sandstorm, which is completely unnecessary, don't need Sandstorm. 
leer and screech as well, which are again completely unnecessary because don't they do the exact same thing? What the hell is this bitch doing sitting here looking at me? Excuse you, excuse you. So what I'm gonna do is I think I'm going to I want to switch train these two. So I'm gonna I'm gonna swap into Tit Duck for this gym, but I'm gonna switch train uh, Saturn and Juvia just because like Saturn Saturn I want to keep up front because it can T wave. So in case like let's say. We're switch training and we run into a water type Pokemon. Obviously, I wouldn't swap into Tit Duck on that, but at the same time, uh, Saturn resists water and we can T wave it. So that's that's a good idea, right there, right there, right then and there. Yo, Challenger, Bugsy's young, but his knowledge. Oh, it's a he! It's a he! Ah! But his knowledge of po bug Pokemon, Pokemon, is for real. It's gonna be tough without my advice. Let's see, bug Pokemon don't like fire. Flying type moves are super effective too. Okay, so we know what works. 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 So is this gonna be a double battle? Is this gonna be a double battle? Tell me it's gonna be a double battle. Ladybug. It's not. What the hell? What the actual fuck? All right, fuck this bitch. Now I I know that they changed a few things in Liquid Crystal. Um, like I said, I'm not too worried about this gym per se. Look at that flame, buddy. Ha. Flame, flame, buddy. Ha. See, like, like that's, that's, that's just like Poison Point. I feel like they upped all of that. I'm going to spam Ember until we get to Bugsy, because I feel like everything in this gym... Oh, wow. Really? It lives Embers? Okay. Okay, then we're just going to Fire Punch everything. Shit. Go back to the Pokemon Center if we need to. But still, I feel like everything in this gym is not going to be a threat. Even if they did change something, I feel like it's not going to be that much of a threat. I don't know. Where are my glasses? Where are my glasses at? I need my glasses. Those of you guys, wait till the, um... Whatchamacallit, the PAX vlog comes out, the final PAX vlog, the big one that's going to be like an hour long, where it's everything all put into one. So a lot of you guys didn't know that I wear glasses, because I really don't wear them all that often when I do vlogs and shit on the channel. And the reason I don't do that is because of, uh, like, the glare. For, like, my monitors or whatever. And, like, I don't want glare to show up on my glasses. But, um, since we were vlogging and we were walking around Boston and whatnot, I had to have my glasses on. So you guys are going to see me with glasses. So that might that might seem kind of weird or kind of awkward to you guys, but I mean, shit, I wear glasses almost every time I sit down and record. Whenever I play video games, I wear glasses and like at nighttime when I'm trying to drive. When I tr when I try to drive, period, I wear glasses cuz I need them for distance. Cuz I'm blind as a fucking bat. Blind as a fucking bat. Well, I'm not blind as a bat, but still. Still, I need them for distance. I need them for distance, you guys. Don't don't make fun of me. Don't call me four eyes. I'll whoop that ass. I'll whoop that ass. Now, I could go through here and try and battle all these trainers. But honestly, I kind of sort of just want to get to Bugsy and get this over with. Get this complete rape and decimation. Paris, really? Level 9. Well, it's level 19, but still, really? Paris? I guess bug type gyms, they really. I don't know. I don't know. I know in uh, Sacred Gold, Gerano made the bug type gym a problem. Because he gave Bugsy, uh, like, uh. Did he give Bugsy a Scizor? I think he gave Bugsy a Scizor and, um, whatchamacallit, a Heracross. So I wonder what we're going to get in this gym. I, I feel, at least I hope, that they gave it something serious. Some some serious work they can put him through. I keep pausing to take a drink from my orange juice. That's, that's like my fuel to keep me going. Oh, you ass, you didn't have to turn around. You bitch, you did not have to turn around. Fucking idiot standing right there. I could have walked right past you, walked right up to the little, the little he she up there, Bugsy. Oh no, no, my bad. We know it's a he. We know it's a he. Weedle! Are you kidding me, Weedle? I'm not switch trainer for this shit. Fuck a Weedle. This is what I don't understand. Like, you have trainers in your gym, and they have Weedles. If I get poisoned from this. Are you kidding me? It was a crit, and I get poisoned. You've got to be joking. You've got to be joking. A fucking Weedle got a crit and poisoned me. Suck a dick. Oh my god, that's so stupid. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. So now I have to swap. B drill. No, you know what? No. Uh, even if I swap, I still want the fucking points. Give me the EXP on Saturn. Fucking scrub. Oh, that's so stupid. I'm mad about shit like that. I'm mad about shit like that. Alright, Saturn. But now we definitely have to go back to the fucking Pokemon Center. So we don't lose Saturn. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Stop, 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 stop. Hold this fire punch. Let me get the one hit. Let me get the one hit KO. Ah! <laughs> Tintug is too OP. Tintug is too OP. Tintug is too OP. 
Oh, speaking of <clears throat> speaking of losing Pokemon, I could a Metapod. Seriously, Pro Metapod. Pro Metapod is in the building. But uh, speaking of losing Pokemon, I completely forgot to cover that in the intro. I was just so hyped. I want to get into the fucking gym. I want to get in here, kick some ass, and just take over it. Cause we taking over one city at a time. All right, so we're at Tiktok up to level 20 now. Sadie's in the backyard raising hell again. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hold on. Hold on a second, you guys. Ah! Okay. Sorry about that. I'm so unprofessional. Ah! I'm so unprofessional, but shit. Sadie, she always does that stupid shit whenever I hit record or whenever I'm doing so. Like, I'll be in the middle of live streaming and she'll be in the backyard raising hell. Rest of the time, she won't do anything. She'll just sit and lay behind me all caught up in a nice little ball. But no, the moment I hit record or go live, she's got to start some stupid shit. I hate that. I hate that so much. But, speaking of stupid shit, I was talking about Poison Point, Seedras, and the Cute Charm Wigglytuffs, and all that shit in that, in that cave. And I said that you guys wanted me to train uh, Nimbus. Well, unfortunately... Nimbus died. I was trying to run from a cloister, and it used protect first turn, and I couldn't escape. And then I went from Aurora Beam and killed Nimbus, which sucks because I really, really wanted to use an Alteria. Then Jeebus died as well. I'm pretty sure from Poison Point. Pretty sure it was from Poison Point. So we have our first two deaths of the LP right then and there, which really, really sucks because neither one of them really deserved to die. I really wanted to use both of them, but I mean, it is what it is. It is what it is. So. Either way, let's dive head first back into the gym. Uh, is that the last trainer that's right there? I'm pretty sure that's the last trainer. Yeah, I'm just battling him since he's the last guy. Since he's the last motherfucker right here, I'm just battling him. I can't believe I did all that intro with the team intro and everything with it with the team breakdown and completely forgot to talk about the dead Pokemon. That's so stupid. And I swear to God, if I get poisoned again from a fucking Weedle, I'm done. I'm done with this game. I'm sure they increased that shit because you guys saw the first battle in this gym. Oh, I got a crit. Not bad. You guys saw from the first battle in this gym, we got that flame body first turn. Like, what is that bullshit? When does that ever happen first fucking turn? Like, let's be real here. Let's be real. So I think they, they increased that that as well because if that's still 30%, that's crazy. That's crazy. Really? And Kakuna flinch, bitch. But 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 bitch. Bug catcher Ali. Bug catcher Ali. Ali. Boom bye. Ali. Boom bye. All right, got another crit. Damn, two crits. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. All right, Bugsy. Bugsy the bitch. Let's go ahead and uh, proceed on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm not going to step in that glitch tiled shit because that's how you wreck your game. So he's there next to Bugsy because we are his equal. He is not better than us. We are better than him. Or at least his equal, I should say. And of course, you guys already know, only you can prevent lost save data, so make sure you hit that save button before anything important goes down. And I don't know about you guys, but I would definitely say that a gym battle is pretty fucking important. So here we go. I'm Bugsy! I never lose when it comes to bug Pokemon! My research is going to make me the authority on bug Pokemon! Let me demonstrate what I've learned from my studies! Nigga, okay, ain't nobody care. That's the problem. Ain't nobody care. Okay, so Bugsy, let's see, you got three Pokemon, what type of a threat, what type of- Really? Metapod? Pro Metapod's in the building? I don't understand this, like, Game Freak, please explain, explain to me why Metapod deserves to be on any gym leader's team. Like, let's be real for a second, why does Metapod deserve to be on anybody's team? Like, that's stupid, that's not even a challenge, the gym leaders are supposed to be challenges, this is not even a challenge, this is stupid. It's a waste of time. This is a waste of time. Twister killed Metapod. Twister, the weakest dragon move out there, killed fucking Metapod. B drill. Okay. Okay, not bad. Level 20, level 20. Is this the ace? Is this the ace? Twin Needle, stop! Stop! Hit two times. Can Twin Needle poison? I wonder. I wonder if it can or not. I wonder if it can. I wonder if it can. Uh, I'm gonna go for Twister. I wanna see how much damage we do to this B drill with Twister. Before we just go out to uh, Tid Dug. Oh, not any damage. Oh, stop, 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 stop. I'm trying to get crits. Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Please stop it. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I'm sorry. Either Tid Dug or Drax should be able to. Mm, stop, 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 stop. A critical hit. Stop it. Okay, not very effective. Good. Alright, and you can catch this fire punch. Okay, and focus energy scares me because crits are what kill people in fucking Nuzlocks. Legit, that's how 90% of people lose Pokemon and Nuzlocke is due to crits. So, fuck that focus energy bullshit. Scyther? 
Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Saturn is level 30. Uh, no, I'm just gonna stick with him. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Look at Scythe at level 22. Fury Cutter. Tank that for me. Ooh, look at that. Not even effective. And the Flame Body. I'm so done. I'm so done. That is more than 30%. I'm sorry. That is more than 30%. Oh my lord. Can we do enough? Can we do enough? Ah! And that's just gonna call for the. That's so stupid. It goes all the way down to like 1 HP. That's so dumb. Catch this Fire Punch again. Tick Duck coming through. Tick Duck coming through. <laughs> God damn, this is like that one episode of the uh, the anime where they had, what was it, Electabuzz and Scyther, the two gyms that raged at each other. Now Mag Magmar is over here. He's like, hey, what about me, bitch? Whoa, amazing! You're an expert on Pokemon! Yeah, no, not bad. My research isn't complete yet! Okay, you win. Take this badge. Yeah, give me the badge, motherfucker. Give me the badge. The Hive Badge. Not bad, not bad, I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take it. Do you know the benefits of Hive Badge? Not of the Hive Badge, just of Hive Badge. If you have it, Pokemon up to level 30 will obey you, even traded ones. Pokemon that know cut will be able to use it outside of battle too. Here, I also want you to have this. Not bad, TM39. TM39 contains Fury Cut. Oh wait, can we teach that? Can we teach that to, to, to Lupita, who makes the best enchiladas in the city of the Mississippi? Can we teach it to him? If you don't miss, it gets stronger every turn. The longer your battle goes, the better it gets. Isn't it great? I discovered it. I'm sure you did not discover it, you dumb bitch. Okay, so let's see here. Can we teach? Can we really teach this to uh, to Lupita? That powerful mud slap? No, Lupita can't learn it. God damn it. Can Lupita, um, 60 damage, yeah, I was gonna say, I'm sure Lupita can learn that. I mean, I know it's still, even though we st <coughs> we still only have uh, normal type moves, but still Swift will do, it doesn't always do 60 damage or some shit? I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. But still, we should be good with that. We should be good. And hopefully Lupita can learn Cut, and we don't have to teach Cut to, like, Drax or some shit, because that would really, really suck. So hopefully Lupita can learn Cut, and that'll be nice, that'll be nice, that'll be nice, that'll be nice. So I'm gonna go heal our Pokemon now. And then head into the Ilex Forest, because that is our next stop. That is our next journey of all journeys. Journey of all journeys at this junction of all junctions. <laughs> at this journey of all journeys. So yeah, let's go ahead and bum rush this shit. Where are we, where are we sitting right now? Juvia is our lowest level, which sucks. I'd like to have everyone up to level 20 right now. But you know what? It is what it is. I'm still going to go with the T-Wave lead strategy and see what we can do. That's the only downside to... um. Oh, God. Who is this? This is not our regular rival. This is the dude, this is the dude that ran into us outside of, um, this isn't Zane. Zane we fought, uh, at the end of last episode, and it's not a regular rival. This is the guy that ran into us outside of Faulkner's gym during the grinding montage. I didn't realize he was going to pop up, and he just, like, brushes out of the way. You again! I think we need to talk! Oh, shit, this isn't talk- is this- is this how you talk? Okay, 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 this is how you talk with four Pokemon? Quagsire! Okay then. All right, so we can't. Is he? He's rocking unaware too. I was gonna use Leer on him. Really? <sighs> okay, this is kind of annoying. This is kind of annoying because I can't. I literally can't do anything to him. None of our Pokemon. Quagsire trumps our entire team. What the fuck? Ice punch! Ice punch! Are you joking? What the fuck am I supposed to do against an Ice Punch Quagsire? Isn't Ice Punch like an egg move or some shit too? What is this bullshit? Eat it up, eat it up Drax. But still, he's just gonna hit me with like Waterfall or some shit. I wouldn't be surprised if he's got Waterfall. Like, legit, what the fuck am I supposed to do against this thing? Oh, not bad! And we get to flinch! Okay, not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad. I legit thought Lupita was gonna die. I legit thought Lupita was gonna die. God damn. Fucking Quagsire. Holy shit, and he's got leftovers. Get that out of here. That Quagsire trumps our entire team. Holy shit. Saturn's level 19. You better get to level 19. Shit. 
All right, so who are you coming out with? Growlithe. Um, honestly, unless he's got like double kick or close combat or some shit, we should be good with Drax. Well, let's go out to let's go out to Juvia. Let's give Juvia a chance. Watch him have like wild charge or some shit. Wild charge, Growlithe. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on. I'm trying to constantly sip on some orange juice while I'm recording this so that I can just keep my voice to last just a little bit longer. God damn. Growlithe is buff buffeted by the sandstorm. Okay, so the sandstorm's not bad to have. Dig! Are you kidding me, Dig? Dig, Growlithe? <sighs> okay. Okay, so Bugsy was not a problem, but apparently this this rival is. God, I'm getting lightheaded. This is so ridiculous. Let me. I'm pretty sure you're 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 bug flying. Okay, I just want to check. I never use fucking lady, and so I don't know what fucking typing is. I know, right? So stupid. Yeah, put that in your fucking cup of coffee in the morning, bitch. How you like me now? Okay, so if he goes, he's not gonna go for dig again. So he's gonna go for a fire type move. Honestly, I, I'd hate to do this, but I'm gonna lean on Drax for this battle. Or I could go out to. No, I was gonna say go out to Sit Doug, but we don't have Flash Fire, and I think I think one of uh, yeah one of one of Growl's abilities is Flash Fire, so fuck that shit. So let's go out to. Let's go out to Drax. Let's go out to Drax because the only thing he should have on his shit then yeah he went for Ember. The only thing he should have right now is Dig that could fuck me up. I swear to God, if you go for it, fucking dig again, and I miss this bite, because you know, you already know this all powerful. But there we go. I was gonna say I might outspeed. Yes, get wrecked, Drax. Oh my God, if we didn't have Drax on our team, we would have gotten screwed over so many fucking times. Electabuzz. Electabuzz. Let's see here, who's best to take on Electabuzz? Huh? I think I'm gonna go out to Saturn. He could have Ice Punch like the Buzz. I'm gonna go out to Saturn and I'm gonna T-Wave it. Because this isn't 6th gen, we can T-Wave in this gen, we can uh, T-Wave Electric types. So let's see here. And the Sandstorm is still up, that powerful Sandstorm. God damn, I feel like I'm playing chess right now. Like, that's why I like playing like Blaze Black in, in games like this that are harder ROM hacks. Just because, like, you don't just, like, you don't always know what to expect. You can just, you don't just walk all over the other guy. Light screen, get the fuck out of here, bitch. You don't just completely walk all over the other person because it's like, oh my god, what are they gonna do? They have unique movesets and everything, it's just like, what the fuck am I about to go into, you know? And it's not bad, we paralyzed since we have that speed as well. And I feel like they should have, like, um, a status ailment that works on special attack, too. You know what I mean? Like, you know how, like, burn cuts physical attack? I feel like they should have a status ailment that cuts special attack. Well, let's see here. I'm gonna go out to Tit Duck instead of Drax. And I hope that's not a bad idea. Thunder Punch. Oh, eat it up, Tit Duck. Eat it up, eat it. Oh my god, that did so much. I mean, it is Stab and it's fucking Thunder Punch, but still. God damn. Please stop. Please stop this bullshit. I think I want, I think I want to heal just because I'm so afraid. I'm so afraid right now. Because I feel like we're, in, we're definitely in crit territory. I'm gonna heal and hope that he gets caught by paralysis. Cause if he does, that's that'd be so fucking perfect. That'd be so fucking perfect if he gets caught by paralysis. Paralyzed and he can't move. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, so we're on even playing fields now. Even though you do have leftovers, but still, I say even because I'm gonna take damage from the sandstorm and he is too. But he's gonna get that all that back. Fucking a. Shit. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna fire punch the fuck out of this guy. Come on, let me get the all-powerful crit. Oh! Do so much more damage. Oh shit! Stop! Calm down. Calm down, please. Calm down. There's no need to be all upset and angry like that. There's no need. But I gotta remember the homeboy with the red hair because we don't have his name just yet. But I gotta remember homeboy with the red hair is rocking a Quagsire, and we need to get someone on the team that will save us from a Quagsire because that. Honestly, it's some biggity ass bullshit. That Quagsire, oh my god. Thunder Punch, stop with the Thunder Punch. God damn. Light screen, good, yeah. All, all that good work that light screen put in for. Shit. 
just die. Just, just die. Stop with the leftovers. Oh my God, let me get some leftovers. Shit. All right, I'm gonna stop with the with the with the heal spam. Just go for the ember. Get the like the buzz out of here. Get out. Goodbye. I like the buzz. Goodbye. 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 And who do we have next? Who do we have next, ladies and gentlemen? A bag on. Ah. I feel like. I feel like it's gonna be like a Dragon Claw bag on or some shit like that. I'm gonna go out to Drax. I'm gonna go out to Drax. And let's just hope it's not a Hydro Pump bag on. Because a lot of people don't know what one of the egg moves for, for a bag on is Hydro Pump. Don't ask me why. It just is. <laughs> hydro Pump Salamence. God damn. Alright, let's just bite the fuck out of this thing and just be done. Thank you! Drax coming through! Drax coming through! Okay, so, that Quagsire scared the fuck out of me originally, but we were able to get through it. Excellent! What the hell are you talking to me for? Like, you judging me, bitch. I'll kill you. <clears throat> My name's Axel. I hope we meet again. Oh, he's really short-spoken. Are you kidding me?! We're gonna have a second battle? Scrafty, tell me something. Is it true that Team Rocket has returned? What? You beat them? Ha, quit lying. You're not joking, and let's see how good you are. Oh my god, we have two battles in a row. Holy shit, Callum Y. Callum Y. He's got a ghastly. Oh my god, Callum Y. Callum, why are you doing this to me? Okay, I'm gonna two-wave the Ghastly. I'm surprised, I'm actually kinda surprised I outsped the Ghastly, to be honest. Because Ghastly, Hunter, and Gengar are kinda speedy. Really, really, doesn't Spike, like, cut the BP? Thunder Wave by 5, okay. So I'm not even gonna play around right now. Drax, come on out and bite the fuck out of this thing. Please just bite the fuck out of this thing, because he, he'd be the one to have, like, well, it's got the physical special split, but still. He'd be the one to have, like, the, the elemental punches. He's paralyzed. Ah, bitch, 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 bitch. <laughs> I was gonna say, he'd be the one to have the elemental punches, because I mean, shit, the Quagsire had fucking Ice Punch, and that's an egg move. I'm pretty sure it's an egg move for Wooper, because that's that's the joke, that's the running joke with Wooper, is because Wooper doesn't have arms, but he still gets the elemental punches or some shit, so pretty sure that's an egg move. Zubat, I'm not even gonna worry about. Okay, so this rival battle's not that bad. Calum's a little punk bitch. He's a little punk bitch with a Zubat, goddamn. Fat Bat, my bad. He's got a Fat Bat. So let's go ahead and just. Destroy this motherfucker right here. I was scared. I was legit scared for a second because I was like, oh my god. I have to fight two of them in a row. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Croconaw. Uh, who would be best to handle Croconaw? Does he have Ice Fang already? Because I know uh, Croconaw gets Ice Fang by level up. I remember that. Hmm. Yeah, let's just stay in with Drax. Stay in with Drax, see what we can do. Level 20. Oh god. Look at his little yabba dabba doo ass over here. God damn. Fred Flintstone. It's Fred from Coliseum. Water gun. Oh god. You could tank it. Yeah, Drax, Drax can tank it. Especially with the sandstorm up. We're good. We're good. Get wrecked. Drax is too strong. He's too strong. Just using bite. One shot motherfuckers. God damn. Oh my lord. Okay, so not bad. So we had three intense battles. Well, I won't say intense. Bugsy was not all that intense. But we still had three important battles this whole time. Scry up there. Hm. Useless Pokemon. Listen, you, you only won because my Pokemon were weak. Yeah, I know, right? 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 I hate the weak. Try after it, Pokemon, train it. It doesn't matter who or what. I'm gonna be strong right out the weak. That goes for Team Rocket, too. They act big and tough in a group, but they get them alone in that weak. I hate them all. You stay out of my way. And wiggling like you is only a distraction. Alright, so can I finally please go and heal my Pokemon? Goddamn. So, with that though, you guys, I think we've successfully cleared out everything here in Azalea Town. Finally. Finally. Oh my god. So, we're going to go ahead and wrap up today's episode here. In the next episode, we're going to make our way through Ilex Forest and onwards towards Goldenrod City. Hopefully, we don't need to do too much grinding or too much training before we take on Whitney. Because um, if not, then we might actually take on Whitney in the next episode. I don't know. We'll see. But still, either way, thank you all for all your support. Thank you for being patient with us while we were at PAX. And I hope you guys enjoy the vlog footage. If you haven't seen the two vlogs that went up already, make sure you go check them out. And of course, the final PAX vlog is on the way probably sometime this weekend. Oh, uh, and yada, 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 yabba dabba do. But besides that, smash that like button for us if you enjoyed. And uh, 
Thank you for checking out the video. Get on me, YouTube 992. Uh, I'm out.